Three antennas. That's a lot of radio power. Let's let's see. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. So if this is the radio tower. Oh my god. What is that? Guys, welcome back to Raft. We are on the final leg of our journey. You see, we have a radio receiver now, and this thing, from what I understand, may be used to find the end game content of the game. Around the map, there are hidden islands, or there is a hidden super secret radio tower that's giant, and we should be able to find it, hopefully utilizing this. This is one of the last items you make in the game, actually. And, well, as you can see as well, we've uh, made some significant base upgrades. Unfortunately, a lot of you may not have been notified from my last video because, well, it got age-restricted and demonetized on top of that, which kind of sucks. But, you know, it's okay. Shark's coming up, I think. Is, is, is it coming in for a bite? Yeah, it's going for a bite. No. Oh, I killed it. I just, oh, and it's floating away. Let's put the sail up. Bye, Jaws. Bye, Carl. <laughs> So, like I was saying before, Carl decided to jump in on this. We've made some very good base upgrades. We now have a reusable anchor. We have a banana hammock, and we have a bunch of other stuff going on that's fancy, and we're pretty advanced into the game. We've almost got all of our blueprints as well. Where's the cable thingy? Where is that? Right there, hidden behind this. So we only need a couple more things, I think, or do we have it all? No, we've learned everything in the game. Like, we're 100% there. We just need copper for the radio antenna to use along with the receiver. And then from that, since we have a battery, I'm hoping the result of that will be finding the secret island that, well, it's super secret and mysterious. And uh, yeah, that's that's a thing, I guess. Guys, as always, if you do enjoy Raft and you want to see more in the future, leave a like on the video. Let me know down below what you think of Raft. If there is a game ending, well, today is the day we find out and we see what happens with said ending. I highly doubt it because this is a survival game and, well, I mean, I don't really see endings in survival games except for, like, well, except for, like, Ark and stuff, those survival games, but, yeah. If there is one, we're about to find it. So, we're currently making the copper to make the radio antenna. Once we have the radio antenna, I'm gonna see what this thing does. I hope it works the way that I automatically assume it does. By you attach it somewhere on your raft and then that will pick up on radio signals and show you maybe like a signal for one, two, and three, and then you need like different antennas or something, or maybe you need to go to different locations. I'm not sure how it's gonna work. Maybe we can call a helicopter or something, that'd be nice. I'd call a helicopter. Then again, we're living pretty luxurious right now on this raft with all this cooked food and stuff, but uh, I'll have to wait and see. All right, here we go. We got two copper. We can make the circuit board. Oh crap, uh, make that. And now we can make a radio antenna. Where is the radio antenna? Uh, I swear I just, there it is, right there. Bam, radio antenna. Okay, so this is make or break. Oh, okay, you can put it down right here. Maybe I should put it up on top though with the receivers though, so it's higher. That might help out more. Oh man, I really hope this can call like a helicopter or we can get some help or something or at least find an ending. All right, there we go. Oh, and it's attached to it. Oh, hell yeah, look at that. So you can have three antennas in total. It connects to that. Oh boy, moment of truth. Let's see if we can get some help. Eh. All right. What do we have here? Antenna number one is active. Antenna number two needs to be activated. Antenna number three also needs to be activated. So I will connect all three of those. We have enough to do it. And then we'll see from there what happens. So we now have enough resources to make the second antenna, I believe. I just got to make my hoobity waddy thingy. Uh thingy right here, circuit board. Now, I need to make another antenna. This guy right here. So we have another antenna. Let's go ahead. Oh boy. Uh, put you right there. Alright, second antenna is now active. Antenna number two. Uh, too close to other antenna. Okay, alright, that makes sense. So I'll have to move this down somewhere. Let me remove it. And move it down to like the end of the boat right here. I'm so glad that didn't break it. I'll put you right there. And we'll have to armor that section a little bit. So let's see now if it's too close to the other antenna. Antenna number one, uh, wrong altitude. So we need to actually make a secondary raised section right here. That's what we need to do. So raise this foundation, uh, this one right here, and I'll try and put it up higher. Planks. You need planks? Now is that gonna be high enough? That's my question. Let's see. Maybe, just maybe, hang on, we got the wire connected. Uh, wrong altitude, needs to be even higher. 
goodness. Yeah, I know, right? All so right. put us put another foundation down, I guess, on it. I can't. You don't... Oh, wait, yeah, I can. Okay, all right, let's there see. There uh, uh, There we go. It's up right there now. <laughs> I guess it has to be two tiers high. Uh, antenna number two is now online. There you go. So we have two antennas working. I'm thinking the third one has to go over in this corner. So I'll turn this off now. Right. Third one probably has to go over like right here somewhere. Okay. So now we have the resources to make a circuit board again. A lovely circuit board and a third antenna. Now we have to hope this spot right here is going to work. Bam. So all three antennas are now connected on the raft, which is good. I can go up here. Let's power it up. Oh boy, three antennas. That's a lot of radio power. Let's let's see. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Oh, look at that. That is so cool. Radio distance 1442. We're not seeing any signals here yet, except for right here in the very corner. So if we can go this direction, we should find a radio tower. Oh, that is so cool. All right, let's uh let's get ready to go that direction, I guess, behind us. We gotta go south, I guess, technically. The wind is kind of with us. I'll tell you if we're getting closer. One third. Okay, we are definitely getting closer now. It's going to take a little bit for us to get there, though. I think I'm going to make us some paddles and we'll go a little bit faster, okay? All right, so we're going to keep on paddling in this direction because that's where the radio tower is supposed to be. The quote-unquote super secret radio tower quoted from their page. And, well, yeah, that should be a cool site. Maybe we'll find some, like, endgame stuff there or something or even rescue. Because a radio tower, you can radio for help. We could probably radio for a helicopter. That makes sense to me. If they go that direction, they had a lot of time to develop the game. I mean, I wouldn't see why we can't be technically rescued. Oh, God. It's it's over there now. What the hell? So we got to go this direction. Did it change the direction? What the hell? We, we might have picked up on another tower or something, maybe. Or maybe we need to leave this thing on so it doesn't respawn. Maybe the island dynamically spawns. But we're at half battery. Yeah, I know. We're at half battery. That's the worst thing about it. Let me see what I need to make for another battery. Um... For battery, we need copper. See, I'd, if I had one more copper ingot, I'd be good to go, but I only got six. I'm oh. dumb. Um, I guess we'll just leave it active for a little bit and then shut it down every now and then. Because, I mean, we're going there decently fast now. Yeah, it's straight up there. Crap, it's going against the wind almost. Yeah, it's straight up there. So I'm going to leave this battery going now because we can make another battery. And... Okay. Yeah, we need plastic and copper and good. I have lots of plastic here. Yeah, there's a lot of plastic. I just gotta find it. <laughs> oh, no, I fell. Nice. Holy crap, that thing's huge. Oh. Damn. That is so cool. Barrel. <laughs> so if this is the radio tower, oh my god, look at how high it is. Holy crap. I think we can make that second battery. Our battery's about to die. Start, uh, start paddling up here. Look at how advanced this place is. Holy crap. I bet at the top of that, there's going to be something we can use to communicate with people. Has to be. And why, wait, why is a radio tower out in the middle of here and half submerged? Look at that. Are you ready on the anchor? Because we're almost here. Oh, yeah, there's a building, like, submerged, too. This must be an island that got taken over by, like, a tsunami or something or destroyed. Oh, no, it's on pillars, though. These waves are, like... Yeah, waves are really bad. Yeah. All right, drop the anchor. Is it down? I'm on the radio tower. Holy crap. Oh, you're going to have to fight to get on here. Crap, do I have food on me? Yeah, I do. It's, at least this one doesn't, like, sink, right? Hey, there's doors and stuff up here. Oh, and a chest. Oh, my God. It gives you a bunch of good stuff. Metal ingots and stuff, too? Wow. All right, you should be able to jump on it now. Oh, God. A wave just sucked me under. You got on? Yeah, see? All right. Now I'll do it. Because yeah. I'm a professional. Oh, I almost made it. Oh, wait. Hang on. There's a oh, section like just... right here, though. Yeah, there's like a section right here. Oh, that's awkward. Okay, maybe not. I don't think you can get up. Hey, there's stuff under here, though. So I should probably try and loot some of this. Pick it up. I'm like in an underwater yeah, zone right now in the... Uh... Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. There's a crate. You get metal ingots and stuff in this. Dude, this is crazy. Is there a secondary level even further underneath? Oh, my God. There is. Better watch my oxygen. Ooh, there's a fire extinguisher. There's that. What the hell is all this? Oh, my God. Look at all this scrap in here. And a crate. Hell yeah. Hell Dude, there's so much stuff. 
This is so cool. I can't wait to get to the top where we see like if we can get rescued or not. Oh. My God, this is so freaking massive. I can't get over it. Like this building, there's something at the very top and it's, ah, I can't wait to see it. I need to see this. You might get bit like once. Eh. Right here. Right here. Oh, you got bit. Ow, what the frick? That didn't sound like How it. How do you get through that? You, that what what did weird. you do? Where are you? Oh, come been, outside. Um, come outside. Where? Yeah, come on. Why? Right here, up here. There you go. Oh. See, this is the section right here I was talking oh. about. There was actually something in here that I looted. I thought I looted in here, or maybe it was a different box. But like in here, there's crates all over the place, and you can loot them and oh. stuff. And there's really good items in them. Usually, when you find something, can't open the lockers. That kind of sucks. Um, there oh, should be okay. some ladders and stuff. Right oh yeah, this no, stuff right too. Here. Yeah, it was up on this second level. Scrap. I was up here. Inside one of these, there was uh, a chest that I had taken. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got to go up on the other end. Oh wait, what's in here? Oh. No, oh, nothing. We already went in okay. there. Birds <laughs> eating the food. I don't even care. It's probably just my potatoes. Yeah. Which I can care less about. Oh, it looks oh plastic. Nice. Cool. Plastic. Oh, you oh, missed I a see. chest. Yeah, yeah, you gotta be really you gotta be really cautious with those because there's a there's really good loot. I'm just walking. Oh my gosh, it's like a maze. Yeah. Oh my god, how did I fall off? I was like floating. All right, so this is... Oh yeah, this is the very top then. That's that's where we need to go. Mm -hmm. With the seagull up there. All right. Um, let me go. <laughs> I'm so scared. Like, what if these stairs give away? Oh, look at that. They have like a little generator there too. All right, what's in here? Uh, We have a bigger... Sa oh, safe people, utopia. What? What is this? So it seems like all the ice on the planet apparently melted. This game is just one big giant nod towards global warming and pollution of the ocean, I feel. Because, like, we see all that plastic. All ice will melt. Scientists estimate two years. Water levels expected to rise several hundred meters. Oh, my God. Australia completely just, uh, covered in water. And then Earth 2020, uh, 2002, 2028, completely covered. Utopia is a set of buildings skyscrapers and then a coordinate map thingy on h something something we can't do anything with this though so there is no rescue there's it's just telling us it's the end of the world look at a raft down there oh my god isn't that amazing like, look at my hard like a work giant it's my hard work Got a light on this so then this must have been abandoned ages ago then what year is it then in this game that's my what year is this 2028, obviously. 2028. No, I don't know, because like it's probably after 2028. Look how... But look, oh, I'm dehydrated. Nice. Um, can I just jump into the water, or will I die? Uh, I think you could jump in, but I guess one way to I'm find going out, right up on right? top of this. <laughs> oh crap! I can't. Oh, there's a rock down there. That's awkward. I'm gonna... Damn, we can't. Uh... All right, I'm jumping in. Okay. Where are you? Right oh, here. all right. I'm gonna jump in too. That kind of sucks, though. It's just like a post-apocalyptic world. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm going to land on you. Oh, I just landed on top of you. <laughs> so then there is no rescue at all. And this is the... Nope. I guess this is the end game, then. This is like... This is it. It's the end of the world. Basically, it literally was the end of the world. Oh, my God. That's, uh... I don't even know how to make a title around around this now, because I don't want to have spoilers in my title. We've used the radio receiver and we managed to find a radio tower. The radio tower itself has shown that it was the end of the world and the planet flooded. The bigger story behind Raft was about global warming and the ice caps melting, causing the oceans to rise 700-ish meters or something like that. And well, everything is flooded now, basically. There is no rescue and we didn't actually crash a ship or a plane or anything like that. We're, we're, we had to make this raft because there's no other land really around. I just kind of question, where are we right now in the world? And wh what is our location on the map? We saw a map up there earlier, and it pointed towards some safety possibly and some salvation, but it's, oh man, it's, it's, oh boy. Maybe they'll release some more stuff with updates as time goes on for the storyline. But guys, for now, that is it on Raft. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, Leave a like on this video, and I will see you in the next video.